myself thank you and it feels really good saying that finally it's been exactly it's actually been a little over a week since I last recorded a video As most of you probably know, I've been sick with the flu, um, uh, and yeah, it's been terrible. It's not like I've been dying or anything, but it's just that thing, it's been one of those flus that just drag on forever, and I'm still, like I don't have a fever or anything right now, but I still have like a runny nose, and uh, I feel like I've been like frozen into ice and woken up after like 50 years <laughs> and you probably wouldn't even see it but if you see something below my nose here it's not leftover snot uh, it's just like after clearing my nose so much my skin has become really dry so it's like falling off maybe too much information I'm back now and thank you so much for all the love that you showed on Olivia's video she's just the best to be able to jump in like that uh, the reason I wanted her to jump in is because I kind of had like a little challenge going for myself I wanted to publish 30 videos in a row you know I was on the daily streak and everything and I got sick on video number 24 and I was like God damn it. And then I was like, please, can you do it? And she, she even offered. Um, so, but then I felt like, I mean, she had a lot of other plans and stuff, so I didn't want to tell her to keep going because, you know, sometimes you just got to give up. <laughs> in a row as soon as I become better again, but I kind of scrapped that as well. I'm sorry. Uh, it's gonna have to be 25 videos in a row. This time it's sad since I was like doing a challenge for myself, but I don't know. I think it's good enough. And now after being sick for so long, I've fallen behind a lot on work and everything. So I, I don't want to push it for no reason, you know?
some days like the logistics of it because even if it's like really fun and I love it it does take like an hour to record and maybe one hour to edit and upload and everything so I think the only one that I can like recall that was like uh, kind of stressful to make was the one where I put my camera here on the desk it was a Saturday shorts and stuff but you guys seem to really like it so maybe I should start recording more when I'm stressed because at that day me and Olivia were literally like we've been doing stuff in the morning I can't remember what it was uh, and then we were gonna go out for dinner in the evening and I was like when am I gonna be able to record so I was literally just we came home I take a shower and I was just gonna get dressed and everything and then I was like screw it I'll just record something right now and it was like super chaotic you remember. 
remember but in the video where I talked about my mine and Olivia's trip to London for Christmas we had one night when we sat down at a bar and we wrote down our goals for the next year and one of my goals was to make do something for like 30 days like a 30 day challenge uh, and it was mainly like an idea to like
so slow. You are so slow. Okay, so here we go. See more. Why can't I find that place where I saw this so clear the other day? And if we look at subscribers for February, the amount of new subscribers in February alone was 3,951. 3,951. So yeah, we're getting famous over here, yo, 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 yo. <laughs> I'm sorry guys, I don't know what I'm doing. I guess what we can all take away from this is that hard work does pay off. And um, yeah, thank you guys so much for tuning in to the channel. And thank you subs who's been here since like almost day one you know who you are
see what kind of creators are there on the ASMR section. And I'm like, I don't understand what's what's wrong. Like back when I was a gamer, a girl could get banned for like showing some skin. But now there are like literal 18 plus very sexual content, like obvious sexual content, and people like linking to their OnlyFans and stuff. How is that allowed? surprised when I went on to Twitch to see that and I feel like it's kind of sad because it would have been fun to do it but there's no freaking way that I'm gonna get into that place the way it's looking now I'm gonna stay here on safe and comfortable and happy days YouTube and do my stuff here
said like She's out there, and I'm back here all by myself, uh, but it's kind of nice. Yeah, I don't think I need to explain myself. It sounded kind of bad, but you know, it's just nice sometimes with uh, some alone time. Especially after being home all alone for like... <laughs> since before that I've always had like sleeping problems and if you're here you can probably relate uh, I mean at some point you found ASMR because you had trouble sleeping and uh, I'm thinking like for the first time ever at some point like in the foreseeable future I'm gonna try to actually have like a proper routine where I go to bed and wake up at the same time every day. Whenever you read about trouble sleeping and everything, that's like the main thing people talk about, but I've never actually tried it because it's such a pain to like do it. And um, a lot of the times I feel like my brain is waking up at the same time as my body wants to go to sleep. So whenever I go to bed, that's when I get like my best ideas and stuff and I haven't, like I don't want that to go away, but at the same time I'm thinking that the reason that happens is probably because I don't allow myself to just be like relaxed and think during the day. Yeah, I'm rambling a bit, but it is a rambling video, so... So yeah, at some point I want to try to go to bed and wake up at the same time every day and do all these. 
these nice things, you know, like no phone two hours in the morning and in the evening. Go read a book before going to bed, stuff like that. Thirty.
it's so far away that the next video is gonna be on Sunday, so maybe I'll just do another one in between, we'll see. so much.